Hey everyone, my name is Mike and welcome to the Luxury Home Channel here on YouTube. Today we're in Celebration, Florida, which is right next to Disney. And this community was actually built by Disney and it was founded in 1994. All the homes have uh, some themes to do with Disney and they definitely do um, have really cool designs and different colonial style houses and Victorian style houses here in Celebration. So if you're looking for something like that and to be close to Disney, this will be definitely a community to check out. The home behind me is a five bedroom home with six full baths rooms and 6,050 square feet of living space. Also has a really nice pool area and outside living space as well. The actual price of the home at the time that we're shooting this is going to be 2.825 million and it's been completely redone on the inside. So they actually took everything out to the studs and then redesigned the whole interior of the home. And you'll be able to get to see that just in a moment as we take a tour of the inside of the home. But let's talk a little bit about the outside of the home first. Uh, this community has lots of sidewalks and lots of walking trails. So you'll definitely see a lot of your neighbors out here. And as you can see, we have that white picket fence that is always talked about in the movies here in this specific of a community. We have this door that opens up here and you go from the sidewalk into your walkway, which is a paved walkway. Um, the garage is actually in the back. There's an alleyway in the back that goes to a three car garage. So come on and follow me this direction. And what we'll see here, we have a nice front yard with bushes on either side of the actual walkway and then a yard on either side, nice sized yard here where kids can play or puppies can be out and you have an even bigger yard on this side. And then of course, behind me, we see this beautiful home and then all the homes here are a little bit different. Even this one here uh, to your left and to my right is an amazing looking uh, Victorian style home as well as your next door neighbor. Uh, these are all the executive homes. They have all different types of home styles here in Celebration. But let's go ahead and go and look at this specific home. We have these columns to go up. We have uh, steps that go to the actual entryway that is covered. And then we have windows on either side. And we have these uh, rose bushes going around each of the windows to give it a really cool look. So let's go ahead and go inside and check out the rest of this home. So come ahead and follow me and we'll go in. Hey everyone, welcome to this beautiful home. The interior of this home is absolutely outstanding. So let's talk about here in the entryway. As I come into the entryway, the first thing I see is how big this first floor space is and how great it would be to have a party here, entertain all your family and friends in this specific home. So above me is this beautiful light fixture. It looks like a snowflake. And you'll see those throughout the first floor of the home. Over here to your right and to my left is gonna be a formal living room and then also a little area where they have the grand piano. So very nice for entertaining. Um, and you can see that we do have those light fixtures here as well and also lots of recessed lights. On the other side of the entryway, we do have a little sitting area where you can sit and enjoy reading a book. And then we also have that same light fixture above me there as well. Over here, we do have the stairway. It has some iron railing here. And then as we go up, we do have glass railing. We'll show you that in a little bit. And then behind the camera, like I was saying before, just opens up into this just huge entertaining area. We have our family room here. Uh, we have the light fixtures all the way through. We have those same snowflake um, light fixtures above the family room, above my head here. And then also behind me in the little breakfast nook and going into the primary bedroom, which is over that direction. Now, what I do wanna show you is the kitchen. The kitchen is, an amazing kitchen. So follow me over here and let me show you this kitchen. So we come here, as you can see, everything in this home is very modern. They did a complete renovation of this home where they took out walls and they took the home down to studs and then actually redid everything from the flooring all the way to the kitchen and everything that we see. So this kitchen has a beautiful countertop here. That's a marble look. And then we do have on this side, we have a dishwasher, which is a Viking dishwasher. Um, and then we also have some drawers in this really large sink area with faucet. Above us are some beautiful diamond shaped pendant lights. And then we have a microwave over here, which has a really cool feature. If I, uh, yeah, to open it up, you actually have to hit the open button and then it actually slides out and then you can close it by hitting the close button. Now on the other side, of this kitchen. We have all these cabinet spaces. So this one here looks like a cabinet. It's not a cabinet though, it's actually the refrigerator. It is a very, very high-end refrigerator. And then of course, all the cabinets here. And then we have 
this stove top. Again, another high-end stove top. It's a gas stove top with multiple burners and then the, also the air vent with this really nice woodworking design going up and out of the home. We have windows on either side uh, to get you plenty of natural light and it looks out onto your backyard and also the pool area. Uh, the cabinets are soft closed cabinets so as you close them they slowly close shut and then all the way back here is another part of the refrigerator on that side is the refrigerator on this side is the freezer and then we also have some glass cabinets on this side for display so you can display all your favorite china or wine glasses uh, plenty of storage here for putting all the stuff that you have in your pantry you can put along here and then we have this Bosch coffee maker um, so this kitchen is very very well laid out with lots of features, very high-end cabinets. We have a little bar area here where you can sit down and enjoy breakfast in a little bit more casual style. Or if you're looking to do something a little bit more formal, over on this direction, we do have the dining room. The dining room has a really cool light fixture as well. It matches the snowflake light fixtures that we saw in the um, other areas by the entryway, but this one's a little bit long to match the length of the dining room table and this has got enough seating for six people and then we do have a little breakfast bar over here with a wine fridge and beverage fridge one on either side also you can see that there's just plenty of light going on all over this home so let's go to your left to my right and take you over here and show you this area so as we come here we'll go right and then Right here is a door going outside, so and actually has steps going down, nice paved driveway going out to the sidewalk for a nice in, uh, exit out of the home or entry into the home. And then we have a full bath here. So we have bathroom here, and then we have the pedestal sink and nice mirror. And then on this side, we do have the shower. It's got some nice black marble tile. The flooring is black and white squares and the tile goes all the way up to the ceiling. And then of course we have the toilet on the other side. So let's go ahead and go back and take you up to, there's two different upstairs areas of the home, but before we do that, I'm gonna show you that where the laundry room is. Right here is the laundry room. So we do have the sink here for laundry sink. And then of course your high-end LG washer and dryer. So let's go ahead and go upstairs and show you that. Now, if you haven't done already, make sure you do me a huge favor like the video and also subscribe to our channel. This door here actually goes out to the garage. The garage is a three car oversized garage. It's a little bit elevated from where we are now. So we have plenty of space and they also have storage space above the car bays. So lots of storage in the area there. Let's go ahead and go up. You can see we still have that same wood, the same dark wood going up the stairs and also these nice moldings going all the way up to the top, meeting up into this office area. This is actually one of the official bedrooms but they have this set up as an actual office, as you can see. So you can either put a bed here, a nice king size bed. This could be a nice little studio apartment for someone, or you can set up like we have here, where we have an office, a little sitting area on the other side. And of course we have a kitchenette area here with a sink and a little fridge. And what's really nice too, is they have this really nice subway, great, great color subway tile going all the way up to the ceiling there as well. Now, over here on my left, check this out. This is a door, but it doesn't open normally. It actually slides open. So you can slide it open and then you have a full bathroom here. So you have really nice ceramic tile floors with diamond and octagon shaped tile. And then you have a little uh, pedestal sink here, which is like a little mini sink. And then a nice round mirror or oval mirror, nice woodworking going around. And then over here to the left, we have a frameless shower where you can go and take a shower with also some nice tiling going all the way up to the ceiling and including the ceiling. So let's go ahead and go right. And this is the actual closet. So we actually step down into the closet and this closet has got three separate doors or French door areas going into some storage space. And they changed the actual flooring here to a more light color flooring, which gives a really good uh, contour between the actual bedroom area and the closet. So let's go ahead and go back downstairs. And as we do that, I wanna to talk to you a little bit about the town of Celebration where we are now. So Celebration was originally founded in 1994 uh, by the Walt Disney Company and was 
you know, designed to be like Main Street USA. Um, and they built a whole bunch of homes and currently Disney is no longer involved with Celebration, but they have a really cool downtown area uh, with plenty of restaurants, parks, walking trails, I think over 20 miles of walking trails. Um, so the actual community is really nice. If you're looking for that lifestyle community, this would be definitely a uh, home to consider. And this is one of the estate homes. They have all different types of homes here. So here we are in the primary bedroom suite. We do have the French doors here coming in and out of the primary bedroom suite. So come on and follow me in. We still have that same hardwood floor going through and I love the design of the hardwood floor and the actual style that they actually laid it in. It's not your typical back and forth. They laid it in a pretty cool uh, shape. And then here we are. So this is a very large spacious area. We have a king size bed here. We have this light fixture above us with the Edison bulbs. Um, and then um, we go this direction to one of my favorite rooms in this house, which is the primary bathroom suite. So come and follow me here. Check out this. We go from the wood all up to this beautiful marble floor. And then right behind me, as you can see, is this shower. This shower is a frameless shower. It has marble going all the way up to the ceiling, has plenty of shower heads. The floor is absolutely beautiful with these different designs going on um, and in hexagon shape, I believe, going out. Um, and then of course, all the different shower heads. You have the rainfall shower head above you. You have the like massaging shower heads in front of you. And you also have the handheld one. Over here to my left is a tub. The tub also has uh, a shower, uh, one that where you can actually pull it out and ha handheld the shower part. Um, and of course we have the marble tile that matches the floor going all the way up to the ceiling. And then we have these little windows there for natural light coming in. On the other side is gonna be dual sinks with really nice faucets. The light fixtures are actually in the mirror. We have some nice light fixtures also on the ceiling um, and the mirror goes all the way up to the roof. Very difficult to get this without getting us in the actual frame of the picture because obviously there's lots of mirrors there. Now on the other side to your right, to my left, is gonna be the closet space. So let's come over here and show you the closet. So this is a really nice closet area. Uh, go, go back to the same flooring we saw throughout the house. All these nice built-ins. You can hang your clo clothes. You even have those little display areas where um, you have the uh, glass front to it. And then we even have more areas for your shoes uh, to go here behind me. We do have a couple windows for natural light on either side of the closet. So that so far we've seen two of the bedrooms and three bathrooms. So there's three bedrooms and three bathrooms upstairs. So let's go ahead and follow me over to the original stairs that we saw when we came in. So as you notice, there's two different stairs. The one we went over before, which was the one over the garage, that's separate. It's not actually joined to the other side of the home, which is over in this direction. So now if you watch this video so far, please do me a huge favor and hit the thumbs up button and also subscribe to our channel. Um, we do put out some really cool luxury homes throughout Florida um, every week. So let's go ahead and go upstairs and I'll meet you up on the top of the stairs. All right, so welcome upstairs. Uh, this is where all the bedroom suites are. We have three bedroom suites upstairs. Uh, right now we're in a landing area and then over here to my left, to your right, is gonna be the largest of the three bedrooms. However, all three bedrooms are very good sizes and can all fit king size beds. So as we come in here, we'll talk about this one. We do have the actual engineered hardwood floors below us. And then above us, we do have this nice light fixture over the bed area. Um, we can see we have plenty of space for a little sitting area. Um, in front of us, looking out these windows is gonna be the conservation area. And then we can also see the little terrace or our balcony area out there where they uh, framed it off with some railing to make it look really good on the elevation on the front of the home. Now, if I go left or to your right, we're gonna see the other parts of this specific home. Now here is gonna be the full bathroom. So this bathroom here, we go into this really intricate tile that you see on the floor, lots of little squares and rectangles. And then we have a nice pedestal sink with a marble countertop. And they did a lot of gold trim in this specific um, bathroom uh, with the actual faucets, the frame of the mirror, and then also even where you can hang your, hang your towel here. And then of course the shower. Um, as you can see, it's also 
um, gold plated and we have the frameless shower. The tile goes all the way up to the ceiling and we have that same uh, intricate designed flooring here on the shower. And then the toilet here is back here to my right. Now, if I go over this direction here, we do have the full walk-in closet. So you can walk in here and they have some shelving here. I probably put a little bit more shelving over here to get a little bit more space for your clothing. And then of course we still have the beautiful view outside of that conservation area. So let's go ahead and show you the other two bedrooms. So follow me over here to bedroom number four, which will be right here. So bedroom four, a little bit smaller than the other bedroom, but still big enough for a good size bed. Maybe a queen size bed here would be the best one to have. Um, we do have a very modern light fixture above us. Um, and then we have a closet over on the other side, which is just the French door closet. And then over here is a full bathroom. So come this direction, I can show you that bathroom. And as you see, we do have um, countertop space here. It's like a floating um, va vanity, uh, frame mirror, and then also really nice light fixtures. And then we have a tub here uh, with the shower fixtures. And of course we have the tile going all the way up and we have a window for some natural light. So let's go ahead and see the bedroom number five, which is to our right. So follow me this direction. And here is bedroom number five. This one is a very nice size bedroom as well. You can definitely fit a king size bed here. Um, we do have the windows that look over the rear of the home where you see all the other beautiful rooftops and all the different designs here in Celebration. It's something that's really neat about Celebration, the different style houses. They have colonial houses, Victorian houses, a whole bunch of different styles to, to um, pick from. And then we do have our bathroom over in this direction. So follow me and you'll see that we have a full bathroom here. This one's beautiful. Again, we have a little bit different tile than we do in the other ones, but also a rectangle tile. We have this pedestal sink with marble countertop. And look at this beautiful light fixture um, above us. Um, I, and we have one also in the, this one matches the one that's in the bedroom as well. Um, that is also very, very amazing. So we have our toilet over here and then we have the shower. The shower has that same flooring and then has tile going all the way up to the ceiling and it has the same sort of shower um, fixtures that we saw in the one with the gold fixtures, but in this one it's chrome. And then behind me is another walk-in closet where you can come and you can hang all your clothes here. And then it also has the views out to the front conservation area. So we've seen all five bedrooms, we've seen all six bathrooms. The only thing we haven't seen is the outside of this home. The outside's got an amazing pool area, as you see here. And then it's just, this is great Florida living at its best. We also have this amazing living area here. Um, over in this direction, we do have stairs that go down and we have an outside entryway to the garage and then also a little small yard and a gate going out to the alleyway behind us. Uh, let's go ahead and go this direction and walk around the pool. So follow me as we walk around the pool. The pool's got really nice uh, pavers going throughout. Uh, and then we even have this nice living area over here where you can sit down and enjoy the beautiful weather. And of course, look at the beautiful homes around you. You can see all the architecture. So as we scan the camera around, you notice the next door neighbor and the architecture there on the ceiling. Uh, they try to do a lot of things based on some Disney movies and, and Disney series that have on before. And you can see that sort of magical feel here. And as we keep on going around, you actually see the actual home that we have here. And the home just scans along. We have this covered area and then it keeps on going over to the area that's above the garage way over in that direction. And then we have this outdoor living area that's covered here. And we have a little dining area set up for six people. And then we have these light fixtures that are have fans built into them and, uh, above us as well. And you, you can even look at the ceiling and how well the ceiling is done uh, over above us as well. So lots of landscaping throughout. Uh, this is a very beautiful home. Uh, it's, uh, it's listed for 
1.25 million. So if you're interested in this home, make sure you give us a call. All our contact information is below if you want to inquire about more information about this or any home in the Florida area, we'll definitely help you. And we do know other realtors in other areas of Florida that can help you if you're interested in Tampa or Sarasota or Miami or wherever you may be interested in the state of Florida. So I wanna thank you all for watching. Have a wonderful day. Talk to you next week. Bye-bye.